Hello folks, how are you doing? It's Don Kelly here on this wet Friday evening. Uh, again, I'm not going to look into the camera, so for obvious reasons, because I'm driving the car. So tonight we're going to talk about a sciatic pain and what is it. So basically, a lot of people who come into my clinic and to present with uh, with pain, especially going into the buttocks or down the legs and a lot of them will say to me do I have sciatica and it's a very common question and what I tell them is sciatica is a symptom and it's the name that uh, Western medicine has put on on this particular condition okay so when somebody says to you that you have sciatica uh, it, generally will mean that the sciatic nerve which is the longest nerve in the body is irritated thus you get the pain running down the leg now not all pain going down your leg is sciatica okay but people can tend to call it that and, de and many different conditions or scenarios can cause sciatic pain so it's very important that if you do believe that you have sciatica, uh, not to Google sciatica and start doing the exercises that they will show you to help treat it because not all conditions are the same and you, you're in danger of actually irritating the condition. So just because you've been, you've been told or you feel that you might have sciatica might necessarily be that because different scenarios will cause the pain okay a bulging disc in your back will irritate the nerve and the pain will go down the leg uh, uh, you know piriformis syndrome a muscle in your butt could cause cause pain you know so it'll travel down your leg but it's not necessarily sciatica you could have trigger points uh, knots in your muscles in your leg, in 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 the in the piriformis, in the gluteal muscle, and these can cause pain traveling down the leg. Tri that's trigger point pain. So not every, and even a tight hamstring. If your hamstrings are in trouble, if they're weak or if they're overactive, they can cause leg pain. But it's not necessarily sciatica. So. All these different conditions will warrant a different treatment a protocol towards them. So what I'm saying is do not uh, presume you have sciatica and Google it and then do the exercises that you will see on Google because they're not all necessarily uh, will treat the problem. And actually, as a matter of fact, in a lot of cases, it will create a bigger problem. So just be aware of that, okay? So sciatica is just a term, it's a name, okay? It's a name where the sciatic nerve is impinged or it's inflamed, thus that will cause the pain down the leg. But it might, it's not necessarily the nerve that can be damaged, okay? Uh, so just be aware of that. Also with any type of sciatic style, pain or discomfort, uh, the exercise you do or, or the stretch you do or whatever, it should not irritate it and there should not be pain so if you're if you suffer uh, sciatic discomfort or sciatic style symptoms and you're doing exercises be it stretching or strengthening exercise and if it's aggravating it you got to stop and don't do it anymore okay because you're only irritating it and in a lot of cases uh, nearly in all cases actually uh, the sciatic symptoms they, they will go away on their own you know, with just rest and uh, proper exercise, uh, they can go away on their own. You might even need to see a physio, and they can go away without drugs or, or medication or anything like that. So try that, uh, rest it, but physio and exercise does speed up the healing process. All right, so I hope that information helps you guys. If you've any queries or anything, just, uh, contact me let me know and I will get back to you as soon as I can and uh, I will uh, give you any information that you might need or want on it okay 
so if you've any queries uh, let me know but the main thing is and I tell everyone uh, there should never be pain in your exercise you should never have pain or discomfort and they should be uh, you know don't exercise or train through pain don't stretch through pain just rest it okay if there's any pain in your exercise any pain in your stretching you're doing something wrong go and seek some help and get it sorted out okay I hope that helps uh, have a great Friday everyone and I will talk to you all soon okay have a great weekend God bless bye bye